Hello everyone. Yes, it's about that time. Our holidays are approaching and I have some recipes to share with you all. So stay tuned for my holiday recipes. We are at home cooking with Miss Brenda D. So welcome from Miss Brenda D. Her family. Hello everyone, how y'all doing on this nice beautiful day? Today we're making a southern sweet potato pie y'all. Yes, my way. And here are our ingredients. Here I'm showing you some of our ingredients. I'm only using two of the eggs and with this pie crust, I'm going to bake this pie crust for like five to seven minutes and before I bake it, I'm going to poke holes in it so it won't uh, accumulate air bubbles. This step is for the ones that loves a crispier pie crust. Here I'm showing you how I prepare my potatoes to boil. I cut them in half and the little long tips I cut off and uh, I'm going to let these boil for about 20 to 25 minutes. If your fork is able to go through them easily, they are ready. Here we are removing our sweet potatoes from our pot and we're going to let these cool. You can also use baked potatoes. Since our sweet potatoes have completely cool, now we're going to peel the outer skin of the sweet potatoes and I'm going to show y'all exactly how to peel them. Here I'm showing you, as you can see, there is a light colored yellow. What you're going to do, you're going to remove that part. That is where the strings are. And some of my viewers was kind of worried about the strings and there are sweet potato pies this is one way to remove them is to remove the light colored outer part of the potato make sure to remove the skin first and then you will be able to see it much better and remove them i'm going to continue to peel my potatoes and then i'm going to be right back Okay, since all our potatoes are peeled, now I'm cutting them into smaller pieces. Now it's time to add the remainder of our ingredients. Here I'm adding our sugar, our melted butter, and we're going to mix these. And I usually mix these until we get all the lumps out of our potatoes. Because we want a smooth sweet potato pie. Here I'm showing you the beaters which does help remove the strings. Here I'm testing our sweet potatoes uh, for the sweetness. I've already added one half cup and I'm going to add another fourth cup because it wasn't sweet enough. It all depends on the potatoes. Some sweet potatoes are sweeter than the others. And if they are, you can use less sugar. Like I always say, make this recipe yours. Here I'm adding some vanilla extract and lemon extract. And now our evaporated milk. And now we're going to mix these ingredients in. Now we're adding in our allspice. Grab 
brown cinnamon. Two eggs. And our flour. Now we're going to well mix these ingredients. Give it a good mix. And then we're done with our filling. As you can see that our filling has gotten really smooth and that is what we're looking for. Okay, now we're going to move on to our next step. This is our pre-baked pie crust. Letting y'all see our pie crust, as y'all can see the holes that I had put in there, the holes keep the pie crust from puffing up as it pre-bakes. Here we are adding our filling to our pie crust. I can smell the aroma of the pie filling before I even put it in the oven, and it smells so, so good. Try not to overfill your pie crust. Sometimes you may have just a little left over. What we're going to do next is place our pie into a preheated 350 degree oven for one hour and 10 minutes. While we're waiting for our pie to bake, I want to do this quick shout out to Miss Sherry Ruck for this beautiful gift that you have given me. Miss Sherry, I'm going to hang this in my kitchen so everyone can see it. And thank you for your love gift and your card. May God bless you and your family. Love y'all. Letting you all know if you have sent me mail or going to send me mail, uh, I I will not be getting it. I am having problems with my P.O. Box mail. So please don't send me anything. So make sure to comment me or email me and I will give you an alternate mailing address. Okay, y'all, let's get back to our sweet potato pie. Okay, y'all, I just removed our pie from the oven and I'm going to let this completely cool. Letting you know I did place it on a wire rack. And we're going to let it cool, and then we're going to be back with the final result. Okay, y'all, we are back. Let's cut into this sweet potato pie. Y'all, this pie was so delicious, and my family really enjoyed it. Y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed cooking with me as much as I enjoy cooking with you all. Hope y'all enjoy this recipe. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. And please don't forget to hit that notification bell so y'all can get our new and upcoming videos. And to all our new viewers and subscribers, you are welcome, welcome, welcome to our channel. Okay, y'all, as always, I'm going to say y'all have a blessed day and bye-bye for now. Love y'all. Stay safe and be blessed. More holiday recipes are coming soon. We are at home cooking with Miss Brenda D. So welcome from Miss Brenda D. and our family. That's a hit!